Hi, I'm Erica from Nation Builder, and in this short video, I'm going to be walking you through the four steps required to connect a custom domain to your nation. This video is good if it's the first time you've done this and you want to send email blasts or you want to connect to a great Nation Builder website. But if you're using a .gov custom domain, please email our help at nationbuilder.com support team because it's a slightly different setup. If you've got any other kind of custom domain, you are in the right place. Let's go. To connect your custom domain to your nation, you're going to need to follow four steps. In order to make this process super smooth, you want to make sure that you have everything that you need before you get started. So step number one, and the first thing you need to check is that you have a custom domain. So mine, for example, is giraffesociety.org. If you haven't purchased one, go ahead and do that and come back to this video. Another thing you want to consider is whether you're going to use Nation Builder to send email blasts to your supporters. If so, are you going to use an inbox like an Outlook or Gmail email service provider, or would you like Nation Builder to provide that email service for you? I'm going to be using hello at giraffesociety.org as the email to send email blasts, and it's a Gmail email, so I'm using G Suite. And the last thing you'll want to have on hand is which one, which domain registrar is yours. I'm using GoDaddy. So with this information, you're ready to get started. Let's move on to step two. Step two is adding the custom domain to your nation. So click on settings in your nation and then domains, and you're in the right place. Click new domain up here in the top right and add your custom domain here. Now it's time to consider whether Nation Builder should manage this domain or you would like to manage this domain. In most cases, Nation Builder should manage the domain. That basically just means that we're going to be managing all of the settings of the domain so you don't have to. Especially if this you're going to be using a Nation Builder website and your custom domain is brand new and you'd like to use it with that website. Nation Builder should manage your domain. And also, if you're going to be sending email blasts from Nation Builder and you don't yet have an email service provider like an Apple Mail or Gmail, and you would like Nation Builder to provide this service, then we should manage your domain. If you want to manage your own DNS settings and you have experience doing this, leave that box unchecked, click Add Domain, and follow our self managed custom domain instructions. For everyone else, Check this box and click Add Domain. Now we're on to step two, which is, sorry, step three, which is to add our name servers to our domain registrar. This is a little bit technical in nature, but I'm going to demonstrate how you exactly do this so it's not too scary. First thing you need to do is log in to your domain registrar. I'm going to be using GoDaddy, so I've gone ahead and logged in and found how to add DNS records. This is going to be different for all domain registrars, so look for help. We've got a couple links here to the most common registrars. So now it's pretty simple. It's all about copy and pasting these six records into the domain settings. So I can see that this is the required value. So I'm going to copy this one, head over to GoDaddy, add a new record. When it asks me which type, I'm going to choose NS. That starts for names, stands for name server. And for GoDaddy specifically, I know that the name that I need to add is this at sign. It might be slightly different for yours. It might be a blank. So follow the instructions. And then I'm going to paste the value in here. Now I'm going to add another one following the same steps. I'm going to go over here. I'm going to copy this and paste it in there. So I'm going to do this. Oops, there's a space there. I'm going to get rid of that. I'm going to do this six times until I have all of these name servers in my domain registrar's DNS records. And then I'm going to hit save. It can take between one hour and 48 hours for these records to propagate across the internet. While they're propagating, your custom domain isn't yet connected to your nation or your website, so it won't work yet. 
If you get beyond 48 hours and don't see green check marks here, then you'll want to get a hold of our support team. And you can do that by using this little messenger here or emailing help at nationbuilder.com. Once that's all done, these will all be checked off and you can move on to step number four. Before we go into step number four, I'll show you down here one more thing that you need to do, and that is let us know what email provider you are going to be using. In my example, I said we are using G Suite, so I would just choose G Suite here. And I'm going to ignore the DMARC record area because since Nation Builder is managing, managing the DNS settings for this domain, we will put that DMARC record where it needs to be so that your emails are sent securely. So then click Save. So now we can move on to the fourth and final step, and that is attaching your website to your domain. So I can show you how to do that using this domain here. Just go ahead and click on the domain that you just added. And it's going to tell us one of your sites not yet attached to this domain. Save your site settings to fully connect your domain. To save your site settings, go into Sites and then click on this URL. And all you need to do is click Save. And just like that, your subdomain is, sorry, your domain is now connected to your website and you're ready to go. One last note is that this um, security certificate status, as you're waiting for those name service to propagate, is going to say pending. And so you can come in here to see how that security certificate is going. If you have any trouble with this, please use the little messenger down here to email our support team or email them at help at nationbuilder.com. For more videos like this, please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you're not yet using Nation Builder, try a live demo by following one of the links in our description. Until next time, see you.